Hello, I'm Dr. Heidi Horsley, Executive Director for the Open to Hope Foundation, and I'm here today with Molly Gander. And I'm really excited to interview Molly because I had her come and speak to my class at Columbia University. She is making a documentary film about the loss of her sister and how it impacted her family. And Molly, can you tell us the name of your film and a little more about it? It's called Peanut Gallery. Uh, I went home a few years ago to Indiana, uh, where I grew up, uh, to sort of speak for the first time in depth with my parents about my sister's death. My sister died when I was 10, and we'd never really spoken about it in depth. So the film is a story of us kind of learning to speak to each other about her death. The film is really powerful because, I mean, I've seen a p some pieces of it and, you know, it really captures how difficult it is to have these conversations. And how old were you at the time that your sister died? I was 10 and my sister was 14. Um, and she had leukemia for eight years. So for most of my childhood, she was diagnosed when I was two and she was six. So. I'd grown up with the experience of her being ill, and the film also um, uses a lot of archival footage to sort of tell the story of our family dynamic during her illness and how that then affected our family dynamic after she died. What message would you give parents out there about helping their kids through a, with a sibling loss? I think just being willing to listen. I think it's probably really hard to take in. I mean, I've gained a lot of compassion actually for my parents' perspective in doing this process. And I think it's so hard because the family's blown apart and everyone's dealing with their own situation. But just being willing to, I think, listen, I, I think helps, even if you can't quite take it in at the time, just hearing. I like what you're saying, Molly, because, you know, my brother died and I had a sibling loss as you know also and the thing is it's a double loss for us because we've not only lost our brothers and sisters we've lost the family we once knew because our our parents often aren't as available as they were emotionally and like you said sometimes they can't really hear what we're saying and so I like the idea of just staying open even if you're not responding just giving kids the message hey we're here if you want to talk about it what helped you not only survive, but eventually find hope again after your sister died? I think doing this film has allowed me to re-engage with the rest of my life, actually. Um, reinvesting in the relationships with my parents allowed me to reinvest in other relationships. And I'm not sure really how to describe it. I mean, I think just my primary relationship in a way was still with my sister if that so you had you had a continuing bond with your sister yeah and she's forever in your heart and in your memories and in your life in certain ways yeah definitely definitely and where do people find this film if they want to see it and i would highly recommend that they do see it the film should be finished by the end of summer uh there'll be a trailer up soon um on the internet, peanutgallerydoc.com. Um, I want to involve you know, community groups. If they want to have screenings, they should get in touch with me. Very good. Thank you so much, Molly, for building awareness and talking about families and the impact of a sibling loss.